welcome back to my channel. I know you guys seen the thumbnail and the title. So today we're making crock pot short ribs. It's been a minute since I used my crock pot. I thought why not make a video for you guys today. Today we're making this delicious fall off the bone short ribs. If you want to see it, keep on watching. Be sure to give the video a thumbs up for me. I'm not going to do a lot of talking. Let's jump right into it. Here we have all the ingredients right in front of me. I have my short ribs here. You'll need about a quarter cup of all purpose flour, a quarter cup of chopped onion or a whole onion. Here I have two cups of beef broth. Beef broth is perfect for this recipe or you can use chicken broth, it's fine. Okay, just use chicken broth if you don't have beef broth. Here I have about a tablespoon of honey, a tablespoon of soy sauce, dark soy sauce, I have some bacon in here as well and we'll be adding one large this is like extremely chunky garlic clove I just cut them like that but of course you can mince them down if you like I have about two tablespoon of red wine vinegar I have salt with pepper okay we're going to jump right into seasoning this beef. Let's get started. Now, what I'm going to do is add my salt to it. Just make sure the salt is spread out all over the beef. Turn them over and add the rest of the salt. Then I'll be adding in some ground black pepper. Now, when it comes to pepper and salt, I usually tell you guys to add base to your taste because some people do like their food with lots of salt and lots of pepper. I like the pepper, but not too much salt. All right. And also we have the bacon here as well, which is kind of salty and just mix that together just like so all right so here i have my skillet i forgot to mention you'll need a little bit of oil or you can use the butter if you like but i'm using about a tea a teaspoon to a tablespoon of oil i am going to make sure it's nice and hot once the skillet is nice and hot I'll be placing them right in here. Now we can flip them over. Nice and golden brown. Next, we're going to cook the bacon. Once the bacon is nice and crispy, I am going to take it out. Next, I am going to add my onions. We're going to fry the onion until they're translucent. Then we can add the garlic. All right, now I'm adding the garlic in. The garlic is going to give you a nice flavor for this recipe, especially I'm using, you know, not minced garlic or pre-made garlic just fresh garlic okay a lot of people said don't say fresh garlic then I don't know what to say it's not minced or pre-made garlic 
Now I'm adding the flour in just like that. I'll be frying the flour for about one minute to remove the raw flour taste. Next, we're going to add the beef broth in. As you're adding the broth, make sure you stir it because you don't want any lump in your gravy. Now a few minutes after this is what the gravy looks like, nice and thick. Now you can turn off your stove. Now is the best time to add the honey. And we're going to add in the, that's the red wine vinegar. It gives the beef a very nice flavor. And also I'm adding the, what do you call it? The soy sauce. Mmm, that gravy looks so good right now. And I'm adding in the bacon. Oh my God. Now is the best time to taste it to see if you need any salt or pepper. Once we're done, we're going to pour it on top of the beef. Oh my God, that looks good. It looks good already. And it, let me tell you, the gravy has so much flavor in it. It's to die for. I am going to cover this and let it cook on high for four hours. If you cooking it on low, it'll take you about eight hours, but I cooked mine on high. So it took me about four hours for them to come out so, so tender. And once they're done, this is what you have. Let me tell you about this recipe right here. Trust me, if you want, this tastes so flavorful. I hope you guys try this recipe out and let me know how you like it. The beef was so, so tender. Look at that, so tender in the gravy. Oh my goodness, so flavorful. Try this out, I'm sure you will enjoy it. I promise you, try it out. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new to my channel. Thumbs up the video if you enjoy it and leave me a comment down below. Thank you for watching guys. I will see you guys on the next video. Bye.